is KNWA News at 10. Devastating images are coming in from Oklahoma and Arkansas today after severe storms and a possible tornado ripped across the two states. Good evening and thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Peyton Yeager. I went to the River Valley today where one neighborhood woke up to a trail of destruction. We heard glass breaking, things falling over. One person saying it looked like a war zone. It's sheer chaos. That's what Justin Carter called Sandstone Street Saturday morning. A bold statement coming from a man who just returned back to Van Buren after serving in the military. A little more nerve-wracking than my deployment. <laughs> Homes leveled and roofs ripped off while families held on to their loved ones for dear life. Yeah, and that baby bed right there. I'm standing in right now what used to be a living room. The homeowners tell me they had two children under the age of three years old. And during the storm, they were even lifted up off the ground. But luckily, the family walked away with just scratches. But they woke up to an immense amount of damage. Well, I didn't know nothing until I walked out. Homeowners say the terror was gone in a flash. It was just about 15 seconds. The potential twister's path leaving behind a frightening scene, but also a stronger neighborhood ready to start over from the ground up. For the most part, everyone's fine. Everyone has their health, which is the main part. Just luckily no one was injured during this entire storm. Unbelievable that there's no injuries. In